And like most of us until recently, I also assumed that these cups could be given a new lease of life along with the rest of our recyclables. So what's going on? To find out more, I'm meeting up with packaging expert Mark Shaler. Who'd have thought the world of coffee cups would be so baffling? What I've been hearing on the street is, it's a paper cup, it must be recyclable, I'll put it in the recycling. Absolutely. People think it's just cardboard with wax on it, whereas it's actually cardboard with polyethylene on it. Polyethylene already doesn't sound so nice. It's, it, well, it, it does its job. It keeps the cup waterproof. It lets it hold water, or in this case, coffee. But the problem with it is, when it goes into the recycling stream, it doesn't allow the cardboard to be recycled effectively. And what makes it worse, it's not just lined with plastic, but you have to use virgin material in the board. You have to chop down new trees. So that you can't make a cup like this out of recycled paper? No, because you've got an open seam here. You get a lot of inks in recycled papers, and they're not allowed to be transferred directly into food. And therefore, you have to have virgin material. This symbol here, with the arrows pointing round in the triangle, everybody thinks that's a tick for recycling, and it, it kind of makes people think that the whole thing's recyclable. So there's two things there. Firstly, the symbol's on the sleeve, not the cup. So the sleeve, that has got one set of re requirements in terms of recyclability. Two, the second thing, that doesn't mean recyclable. That can just mean a way of informing you what material it's made of. This one's really interesting, because this one has the equivalent of the sleeve stuck to the outside. Ah. And, and that, that's recyclable and okay. made of recycled material, and that isn't. So that's got a little symbol there, which people take as a, a, as a sort of eco-tick of Absolutely. some kind. Have you ever seen anyone take that off and put that in the recycling and that in the general waste? Only me. You're probably the only person in the country who Absolutely. doesn't. Absolutely. So millions of us are putting these cups into recycling bins. They're not going to be recycled. They have to be sorted out. Yes, yeah, someone's got to solve that problem. Or you get rid of that entire load of paper, you can't recycle it because it's too contaminated. So this is a nightmare? Completely. Clearly, none of these companies is feeling the pressure from their customers to act on this. And that's because their customers think they're already recycling. The public don't know there's a problem, so the public's not asking for a solution. The booming UK 